The traitors Diane revealed all on the intense build-up to the dramatic round tables. The series icon joined her son and co-star Ross on Loose Women on Friday to discuss the series ahead of the finale on Friday night. Diane revealed secrets from filming, including what happens before the banishments and why they are so dramatic. After co-star Charlotte told this morning that the round tables actually last for hours and not the 10 or so minutes we see on screen, Diane also revealed what happens prior to the accusations at the table. It sounds pretty tense too, as Diane told the Loose Women panel how the Hunger Games music is played and the players are not allowed to talk for 10 minutes, before host Claudia Winkleman allows the round table to begin. Diane revealed she was left shaking during one moment, as the nerves got too much. She explained, you look at the round table and you think, I can do that. Oh my god. They play the music from the Hunger Games which is the Hanging Tree, if you've ever heard that. Wow. You have 10 minutes of this, you're not allowed to talk. The cameras are just going up and down, and you're getting ready to accuse somebody. We've got these big wine glasses in front of you, I couldn't even hold mine with one hand. It's really clever. We know this is drama, we know this is just fun and we loved it by the way, but that was intense, honestly. It comes as their co-star Zach told this morning he was used and discarded by the traitors. Zach was the last player of the series to be murdered on Thursday night ahead of Friday's finale. One more player, Jasmine, was eliminated in the round table after this leaving three faithfuls and two traitors to battle it out in the final. Speaking on this morning on Friday, Zach addressed his exit at the hands of traitors Harry and Andrew, with him asked about being so vocal on the show. Zach addressed the fact his outspoken nature and him sharing so many theories probably allowed him to remain on the show for so long, before brutally being dumped at the end. Of this, Zach said he was used and discarded by Harry, as he shared his hopes for the faithfuls to be victorious and win the prize money. Speaking to hosts Dermot O'Leary and Alison Hammond, he said, It was a little bit gutting but I underestimated Harry a little bit. He had me wrapped around his finger, he used me and then discarded me like a rag. On who he wants to win the series, he added, I'm out here praying for a faithful win. I'd love to see Evie win, but I think Harry's got it in the bag. He's so good at it isn't he it hurts. It comes as Jasmine told Lorraine host Christine Lampard how she too hoped for a faithful win. The Traitors Series 2 concludes Friday at 9pm on BBC One and BBC iPlayer.